Hello everyone and welcome. What we can't complain about today is the weather. Absolutely perfect playing conditions. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and my partner ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Porto taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, here's the starting 11 for Porto. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2 and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy starts in goal. Thiago Silva plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. N'Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today is Romelu Lukaku. And now they get the ball rolling. The Chelsea move still flowing. Advantage to them. Lukaku. Mount. And he's gone for power. So close to finding the net. That's fine play to keep control of the ball. Possession one. Well, visionary passing, and they could do damage. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there he's not going to take any messing about here. He must finish! In it goes! An early goal! No wonder they're celebrating! Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Jorginho. Conte has it. Reese James. Christensen. Thiago Silva. Jorginho. Conte now, Lukaku. Well, they keep the ball moving. 
But just like that, possession changes hands. Mehdi Karami. A creative look about this. Karami. Alert defending. Pulisic. Well, they did have the ball, but not anymore. Mehdi Karami. A chance to whip it in. Karami. Physically strong and Will he find the net? That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. Now sending it in. Now really meat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. Well, he keeps going. Oh, great defending. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. can they do from here chance to finish oh a stellar piece of defending it is to be a throw in Mateo Suribe Porto have given it away he's protecting it well And a fine tackle. Given away by Chelsea. Well, Porto haven't been able to dominate the possession, as those stats tell us. But their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. How about the cross? Possession and patience, the watchwords. I just couldn't play that decisive ball. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Uribe. Takes aim! They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. Well, a second goal for them here. Reese James. Conte has it. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your take. Well, they're dominating this first half. Their approach play, their cleverness around the box, and the finishing have been excellent. They just need to continue this going into the second period. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Something to worry about here. A goal! And it's very much game on here.
Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So underway once more, and the push is on from Chelsea. Can they find a leveller? Pulisic. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? This could be the equaliser. Really vital interception here. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. Really nice ball. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Well, that's so tight, isn't it? But on this occasion, he doesn't get the benefit of the doubt. Porto have given us away. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, when Romelu Lukaku is on, he can be well-nigh unstoppable, but off his game today, Stuart. Yeah, he's not played well, has he? He's just failed to have an impact here. Mind you, I think we could say that about the whole team. He just hasn't looked like scoring today. Well, underway once more into the second half. And from a Chelsea point of view, it's all about battling back. Rhys James. Lukaku. Ball played nicely. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. And Pulisic has it. No two ways about it, a wild, wild attempt. Well, it's so hard to get this right, and he just couldn't adjust his body quickly enough. Taremi. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Decided to come in from the flank. Oh, it's a penalty! Just what they wanted to avoid, given the scoreline. And the upshot of it all is a sending off too. Well, it was certainly a penalty all day long. A sending off, I'm not quite so sure. Time for a change then. A chance to extend the lead. And the penalty is converted. A goal it is. And now he can exhale. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Mount. Well, Chelsea have had so much possession, as you can see, but most of their passing has been in deeper areas. Unless they start getting it into their front players with better quality, they'll struggle to turn this one around. 
Lukaku and blocked for now. Chilwell retaining possession, proving difficult. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Good visualization and execution. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. But a shocking pass, really. Now Chelsea showing good width. That's Pili Quetta. That's a useful cross. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Good tackle. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. But they took care of the situation defensively. Can they hit on the break? Christensen and Golo Conte. Lukaku. Conte. Just the challenge that was required. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Ball lost by Porto. And he keeps going. Chilwell. And with that, the attack fizzles out. He made it look simple, really. Mount. Aspiliqueta. Mount. Possession one. Just 15 minutes remaining. Very quick thinking there. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. They need to get bodies back. Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. Lukaku. Conte has it. Aspili Quetta. Mount. Conte. Mount. And the cross goes in. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Substitution time it is. And short it is. Perfectly fair tackle, and it will be a corner. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And over comes the corner. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. A danger here as he runs at them. Lukaku. And Golo Conte. And return to Ziyech. And dispossessed. 
Now can they counter clinically? Mehdi Karami. Oh, a nice looking pass. Is this the moment? Great defending here. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. And the ref just far too close to the goalkeeper. Conte. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Ottavio. Well, strong play here. So the final whistle and Chelsea take nothing at all from this fixture. What did you make of it? You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball and then just a few mistakes at the back and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer and Stewart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, he certainly had an impact on the result, not least from 12 yards. He always looked confident, though. You just didn't expect him to miss. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. And after the cross, a tremendous block. Something to worry about here. A goal! And it's very much game on here. A chance to extend the lead. And the penalty is converted. A goal it is. And now he can exhale. <laughs> 